Welcome to this Betfair Beginner's Guide. I only do in-running horse races, and that's, so this course is going to talk to you about that. Now, in actual fact, if you're new to trading on Betfair or you're new to trading on any type of sport, a lot of the things I talk about in this will help you with any sport, quite frankly, but it's specifically aimed at in-running or in-play horse races. I'm a member of Back for Profit. This course, though, has got nothing to do with Back for Profit. I'm not getting paid by Andrew to do this, but I will leave a link uh, below so you can go and read about his course. And the only reason I'm doing that is the fact that I've been a member for five years. I think it's brilliant. He's the best in-running trader I've ever spoken to ever. I've watched him trade live. I've seen his profit and loss. I know how good he is. I've never seen anyone better. And he's turned my trade around when i first joined before i joined back for profit i just lost consistently for years and he stopped me from losing quite quickly and i've been profitable ever since so i'm just doing it really as a thank you to him and also because i enjoy doing youtube videos and if this gets me some subscribers great now it should do because i'm not going to charge for this video series but i'm going to do a few videos covering exactly how i would trade what i would do if i was starting right now my process what i would do and you can learn along and, and do that the only cost is you have to subscribe to my channel and it's free to subscribe so just hit the subscribe button press the little bell so when i do a video you'll get notified that i've done a new video so you can watch part two but also please like the video and comment in the comments and say, yes, I'd like to watch part two. Because if there are not enough people that subscribe, then there's not much point in me doing it, quite frankly. So what am I going to cover over the next few videos? I'm going to cover the process, watch race replays. OK, you don't need, need Bet Angel. You don't need Bet Fair. You don't need anything. You can watch race replays via racing TV or at the races on their uh, websites. So you just need a laptop or a computer. So watch race replays so you can start to see the signals. I'll talk to, the, to you about those in the next video, what you're looking out for. So you're watching race replays. Uh, the next video after that will be about watching the races live with Bet Angel open so you can see the prices. So you, the signals that you're going to learn in the race replay bit, you can see that on the live one and you can watch what that does to the price and start to spot where we're going to be trading. After that, the next step will be trading in play money mode or as Andrew calls it, tra training mode, not using real money. And I have a strong view about that, by the way. People say to me, oh, it's not real. I don't, you know, it's not real. I don't take it seriously. Well, you should. You know, if you can't make a profit, in play money mode don't kid yourself you're going to do it with real money because you're not okay so i'm going to talk to you about that in the in the next video and then after that it'll be live mode with real money and i'll talk to you uh, about stakes and how to set your stakes up and how to set your bets up and your liability up etc so that you are never ever ever putting your bank at risk if you do this properly you should never ever ever need to reload betfair ever again now, people often ask me, how long will it take? How long before I become profitable? I can't give you an answer to that because it's it's like the answer to how long is a piece of string. It just depends, doesn't it? There's a, there's a great poker saying, which is poker's a, a, an easy game. It takes 10 minutes to learn, but a lifetime to master. And with trading, the way that Andrew's taught me and the way I'm going to try and teach you, you'll very quickly understand what set of circumstances I'm looking for before I enter a trade. But having the discipline to just wait and wait and wait for that correct situation takes an awful lot of self-discipline and that's where people fall down. People tend to join these courses or try new things because they want some sort of get-rich-quick scheme. Everybody wants the view from the top of the mountain, but nobody wants to climb. If you want to get to the top of the mountain, you're going to have to work hard it's as simple as that i hope you find this interesting and if you do don't forget let me know otherwise i'm not going to do the uh, part two and so on